Hey everybody, it's Amy Dickinson Campbell with the Space Weather Report, and this is going to be for Wednesday, the 7th of June. All right, guys, so I apologize for the Tuesday thing. Again, I went out with my mother and my aunt again, and uh, had vodka again, and woke up with a hangover again. So I didn't do the Space Weather Report yesterday, so sorry. One of these days I'm gonna learn not to do that. All right, solar winds are blowing at 419 kilometers a second. We have primary C-class flares, but we do have an increased chance of M and X. But right now, our neutron count is 0.7% below the maximum. So that's really good. We'll take it. It's still elevated, but it's down. We'll take it because, you know, it can cause nausea and headachey and, you know, stuff like that. So if you're feeling it, take a break. Hydrate. Stay shaded. All right. We've got a 30% increased chance of M-class flares. 10% increased chance of X-class flares, which means take care of your skin, check on your animals and your plants, make sure they have some way to get some shade because those extreme flares are, ex there's no, we're not getting the, the UV protection like we should be in a solar maximum cycle. All right, geomagnetic activity, really minor right now. So 5% to 20% potential geomagnetic activity in the next 24 to 48 hours in the mid latitudes and five to 20% severe activity at the poles. So not too bad. Um, there was a couple of asteroids on the radar you know, for the seventh. One was like five lunar distance, the other one was like six lunar distance, so nothing too close. All right, guys, again, hydrate, stay shaded, look out for your plants and your animals, your elderly and your infirmed, and each other. Protect your skin. If you don't need something, unplug it. I do get questions about, you know, will surge suppressors, surge suppressors work? Yes, they do. But if we get extreme coronal mass ejections or extreme solar flares or anything that can bugger the uh, the satellites or our power grids then it could cause uh, it could cause your your electronics to fry so yeah the surge suppressors are great but if you don't need it just unplug it but if you're a contortionist in order to get to it then you know use your surge suppressors all right guys send in love and I will see you again on Thursday thanks bye